Our next case study is another late model Mustang fuel injection uh, engine transplant. We have a Cobra kit vehicle with a 1989 5.0 sequential fuel injected engine. The customers complain as it runs rough, uh, cold or hot, it will stall. It's got an idle surging up and down. It even is surging under cruise and we have black smoke. When we inspected the spark plugs, they were rich fouled. When we pulled trouble codes, we have a code 41, which is a lean indication, which may sound strange that the computer thinks that the fuel system is lean, but all of the other indicators, the spark plugs are rich fouled, and there's black smoke coming out the tailpipe. So further investigation, and using all of our senses, we could see that the unique side pipes that uh, come off of the cylinder heads, and individual primaries lead to a single pipe in the side pipe. And this is where our left and our right oxygen sensors are found. So we have four primary pipes feeding into one pipe on the Cobra. Now in this single pipe area is the oxygen sensor so that it can sense the oxygen content in the exhaust from all four cylinders on each bank. Taking a look at scan data, just idling here, we've got an RPM of 872 RPM. We've got mass airflow of 5.8 grams, so at idle speed on a five liter engine, if we use the plus one theory, that'd be about six grams, that looks okay. Nothing abnormal in engine coolant temp sensor at 201. Incoming air temperature at this particular time in the shop was 68 degrees. The bank one oxygen sensor was really low at 0.128 volts DC, and the other bank, two, was at 0.232 volts DC. You can see that those are both lean indicators with short-term and long-term fuel trim almost pegged. Long-term is pegged at 25% positive. The computer's adding fuel and the short term is almost pegged. The throttle position sensor looks okay for a closed throttle, it's under one volt, and the barrow frequency would equal somewhere about a thousand feet above sea level at 156 hertz. So what we can conclude from this is the oxygen sensors are indicating a lean mixture and the computer is responding by adding fuel and causing the engine to run rich. The question is, could we have defective oxygen sensors? We have to consider that. If the oxygen sensors aren't working, the computer will keep adding fuel, fuel trim will keep going positive, basically trying to get the oxygen sensor voltage to come up. And if they're not working properly, they won't come up, so the computer will think we're lean all the time. We could also have a circuit problem between the oxygen sensors and the computer. Of course, that means you'd have a circuit problem at the same time on both the left bank and the right bank. Not that it can't happen, but it's kind of out there. Now, upon further inspection, we did notice that we had an exhaust leak where the four primary tubes enter into the single tube, as you can see here. And what's happening is the velocity of the exhaust is drawing fresh air in to all four of these primary pipes. The oxygen sensor is after these pipes. So if you think about it, when we have a combustion occur, we have 21% oxygen in the air, we have hydrocarbon fuel. If we have a good combustion event, we will consume or utilize almost all of the oxygen.